Brisbane have ruled out captain Darren Lockyer for Sunday's match against Newcastle due to his troublesome knee. The same game, Ben Cross will make his club NRL debut with the Knights. Injuring his wrist in the pre-season, Cross hasn't played a top-level match since Melbourne's Premiership win and knows it will take a game or two before he's back on the pace. By his own admission, Ben Cross is a terrible spectator, but the last four weeks of frustration ends on Sunday against the Broncos. While his wrist isn't 100%, there's few doctors that would argue against his return these days. Yeah, a little bit of frustration might come out, but um, no, it'd be good just to get a, get the shoulder and a few pads and plays and that, get the contact back. Quite literally, Newcastle's biggest off-season buy, Cross is comfortable with the expectation that comes with it. In fact, he's relishing the chance to lead an unheralded pack against one of the competition heavyweights. Sort of had a similar role in Melbourne. There was a core group of players that sort of in our forward pack. We sort of tried to do that together and hopefully um, just I can inspire players to play harder or whatever in the way I play um, and sort of lead by example instead of by, by words or whatever, just by the way I play the game. While he returns, the club has lost Jared Mullen for at least a week, despite the 5'8", getting news his calf muscle tear isn't as bad as first thought. Chris Bailey takes his place in a revamped Knights lineup that also welcomes back Adam McDougall for the first time since round one. Cross has been named to start, as has Corey Patterson, with Chris Houston on the bench with a host on standby.